I used to go to UNT, so Spencer69 is a current UNT student, and he has the Ka tag on. So he's probably repping his UNT boys. I hate I hate that though, because I'm a I'm loyal to UTD. You're a rocket. No, I'm a comet. Oh, excuse me. You stupid idiot. You're a comet. <laughs> Whoosh! <laughs> oh, that's really good. I love up air back air. Just the You're way allowed like... to. Oh, what happened? He died. I did. I looked away for He's literally gone. a second. Yep. I think you should be allowed to wobble anyone who currently or formerly wobbled. As like, this like Geneva Convention punishments, you know, like using uh, chemical warfare. I think you're right. So, that all could have been avoided with some smash DI on that down air. Yes, you DI hard down and out, right? Well, you D okay, so you <laughs> DI down and away and you buffer roll. If Ice Climbers do a uh, short hop down air, you can just do that and you'll get out. If they do a full hop down air, you have to smash the eye. Okay. I watched Diz Kid's tutorial on that. When he did like a seven hour stream dissecting Ice Climbers. Oh my god. Spencer69 is getting wrecked. Oh! Dang! Oh, he was really getting styled on there. Damn, I really wish that dunked. I really wanted the dunk, too. But it was not meant to be. Or, like, turn around back air. That would have been sick, too. I think ending handoff combos and back air is really cool. Mm -hmm. It's more difficult. It's worth more points than that. Or turn around fair. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Turn around, like, wave dash back. Mm -hmm. Now that is cool. The old, uh... Oh, we're going back to Battlefield. I actually don't disagree with this, I think. I don't know. He just kind of got outplayed. I don't think it was anything yeah. wrong with the stage. And he I do think to... Battlefield is really good in this matchup. Yeah, he needs to utilize the platforms a little more. Yeah, yeah. It's hard for ICs to deal with, like, dropping down and getting shine. Yeah, drop shine, run off shine is really, really good. Uh, jump in shine. Oh, Aerial shine is kind of good in this matchup. Yeah, absolutely. You can get in and get out yeah, really easy. Without aiming for their face is the important part. Right. All right, he's got a mid. Bananas? How close does Nan have to be the lead to always forward throw? Does he just know or what? Um, he probably knows. Yeah. I know it's. I know it's not super far. You can kind of be like middle of the platform, if you will. Okay, so it seems where he's what he's aiming for. Right. It's also possible that she just happened to forward throw. Could be. Who knows? That happened twice in a row, though, and it's in a similar spot. They're just on the opposite sides of the stage. Oh, this is bad. He... He's going crazy. <laughs> I played a lot of friendlies with Connor today, and he did that a lot, where he just desynced the, the climbers and just start <laughs> slamming the C-stick. <laughs> he doesn't desync ice block, he just desyncs smash attacks. Yeah, he's just like, a, he's a, a whirlwind of hitboxes. Yeah, he loves his smash attacks. It's like the mosh pit theory, where you're supposed to just take up as much space as possible and flail around. Connor's definitely not like a player that faces his neutral like around wobbling, but he's very, or like grab punishes now or whatever, but he's yeah. very good at like when he gets an opening, converting into a grab at any point. Yes. He definitely knows his character's strengths and weaknesses. Oh wait, Spencer has turned this around. I didn't even notice that he was, he was winning now. That was really good. Another thing that Connor is super good at is using mana as bait. And like, he, a lot of times he plays like he would if he's just playing Popo and he just dash dances. Yeah. But he just has that, oh, oh my god. He just, he just has like Nana there to act as a defensive wall. Just as a body. Yo, get him Nana, let him know. Oh, he, she just jumped out of there. Oh. Straight, get up. Nice, Mesh Dio. Yeah. God gets out of it. I wish Connor would react and go for react and tech chase more. I really like up there comments, which isn't a bad thing, but yeah. I think he does. There is more guaranteed damage a lot of time. Oh my god. 
Nope. <laughs> that could have been something cool, but it wasn't. Oh! Man, sometimes you just think you're okay, and you get down smashed. Uh, according to Diplomatic Toucan, Nana throws at to the ledge at the light part of Battlefield. So, I see you right there. So, right here in Cold Four Throw. Uh, oh. Oh, he doesn't even... He's disrespecting him! Handoffs. We did this. This was our fault. I voted on that. I, yeah, this is better. 